the Haitian kidnappers. Now we can just wonder how a group of Christian preachers toured Haiti collecting children, not orphans, but from families. But this is not unusual. It is their MO. The stolen children, the false adoptions, is a common theme throughout the whole of the British Empire, throughout the whole of Christendom, in every race and nation of the earth, the Christians have stolen children, told them that their parents are dead, and then brainwashed them with the Christian ethos, and then sent them back, alienated from their people, but obviously much more materially successful. So they get the children, and the first doctrine they teach is original sin, that man is a sinner, that your parents are sinners. Now this is grooming, because it's destroying the adoration of the child for its parents, the innate love that should exist in the family, that should respect the relationship for the father and for the sons and for the mothers and daughters in the family. But the Christians teach these stolen children that there is original sin. We are all sinners, your parents are sinners. So they divide the child off from its parents. Now this is grooming. They then say to the child, you know, give them an image of a man nailed to a cross, saying that you must believe this is the only way to God, you must concentrate on this man's suffering, that this man is suffering because of your sins. This is what they tell the children and they have it religiously drummed into them at every religious service, there's Jesus being crucified, a man, sometimes even life-sized man, nailed to a cross in our local churches, a horror and a suppression and the abuse of our children's minds.